G'day Capricorn, welcome to TJ Tarot Down Under. Gonna do the love energy coming towards you as that now. See what's going on. Just basically, as I said, as it written in the description box, who's thinking about you when it comes to love and what are their intentions. Alright, let's go. Give me three cards for the love energy coming towards Capricorn, please. Thank you. Clarify. Oh, we need to shuffle, don't we? <laughs> um, it's a general reading, so I take what resonates, leave the rest. If it doesn't resonate at all, it's not your reading. Um, check out your other placements or check out my playlist. See if something resonates for you there. Okay, let's go. Clarify card number one, please. If you're a cross watcher and this isn't about you, then it's, you know, I'm not like that. Well, then it's not about you. <laughs> All right? <laughs> it's not about you. <laughs> Someone else. All right, clarify card number two, please. You know, if it's not you that's like this, then it's not you. Card number three, please. Don't need to get offensive. All right. We have let go of control issues. Allow this situation to unfold naturally. Ooh, going with the flow. High Priestess. Okay. Ace of Swords. Mm. Queen of Swords. And ooh, three of swords, wow. <laughs> yeah. So, control issues, yeah. Keeping secrets, yeah. The secrets that they've kept from themselves, I'm feeling. And they're into, oh, I'm hearing your in, their intuition is telling them to speak their truth. Be honest and speak your truth. Come correctly, <coughs> regardless of heartbreak. You know, Capricorn, you could come correctly or you could break their heart. Like, you know, they just need to be honest. That They don't know everything. And you can't control the situation. Um, I think they're, that's what they're seeing, that they can't control the situation. You could come correctly or you could break their heart. And that's the truth. And their higher self knows that. Like, you know, you can't control someone else. And you control yourself. Wedding. This situation involves marriage. Ooh, four of cups. Ooh, okay. Six of swords. And the devil card. Wow, that's your card, Capricorn. They're not interested in an offer from... Oh, not interested in commitment. Not interested in an offer from possibly someone that they're married to. They want to move to calmer waters and move on from that. Mm -mm. Could be moving on from a toxic relationship. I hate that this is your card. I hate that this is your card. <laughs> Not interested in committing to something that's toxic. Wanting to move on from that. Or not interested in renewing a marriage and wanting to move to move on towards you, Capricorn. Yeah, not interested in going back to the past. Or, you know, getting married's not something they're interested in. Like the officialness of it. Hmm, flirt, extend your light-hearted energy to others. Hmm, great. Two of swords. So, lots of... Hmm, yeah, nah. This one try. Yeah, they try to control the situation. But the truth is that they know they've got no control. It could go either way. Commitment is something that they're not interested in. I think they're just interested in a bit of last 
with you. And f they'll flirt with you, but they're not going to make any sort of decisions about anything. Yeah, this is interesting. Okay. Uh, all the decks are listed below in the description box, too. Clarify. Oh, no. Give me three more cards for Capricorn. For the love energy coming towards Capricorn, please. Two more. Oh, we got them. Okay, that was nice and fast. I like that. Clarifiers. Card number one, clarify please. There's a second row. Hope you're all doing well, having a good weekend. Card number two, please. And card number three, please. we have service it feels good when I can help others mm. eight of swords and five of cups wow see this is all about doing themselves a service they don't care if it drives you crazy or if you end up disappointed in this situation, they know they're going to disappoint you, but they want you stuck in it. Yeah, they want you stuck in their head, doing themselves a service, getting you thinking about them all the time while they disappoint you. Ugh. Failure. I understand that a mistake is only an opportunity to learn. <sighs> Queen of Pentacles. See, failed my commitment. Well, this could be you, this could be your energy, male or female, loving, stable, grounded, committed, very good energy. Yeah, but see the death card, ending that. Ten of pentacles, ten of cups, and the seven of swords, yeah, see? They, they want it to fail. The love, stability and commitment here comes to an end will come to an end because long-term stability and long-term love is a lie to them. It's cheating, lying, stealing. It's a lie. But, yeah. So when they're not interested. <clears throat> Honesty. Okay. I can't always expect the truth from others, but I can expect it from myself. <sighs> See, this control issues, they think that they know what's best. They're keep, no, they're keeping secrets, trying to control the situation. They want you to be honest and come correctly while they get to break your heart. Oh, I don't like them. See, honesty, four of pentacles, they holding back from being honest. Two of pentacles, I'm an error and never, never making a decision. Juggling people. Five of Pentacles. Leaving them out in the cold. Honesty is out in the cold. And Seven of Cups. Confusions and illusions. Wow. So they hold back from me being honest. They juggle around the situation. They'll try and leave the, the conversation out in the cold and cause confusion and illusions. Wow. This is a dodgy one, Capricorn. Stay away. Oh, yeah. Hmm. Yeah, because they're immature. Acting like a child. Yeah. Or they possibly have children with someone else. Who knows? But I don't involve children in the readings. And the energy knows that when I do readings. That's an aspect of them. They're, they're just immature. 
King of Cups. Trying to control their emotions here. They work really hard to try and control their emotions and not show any. Yeah, because they're on the lookout for an empress. Someone who'll grow an empire for them. But they don't want to do that work. Yeah, that's that's what they're wishing for. Wishing upon a star that someone will just give them everything. That's what they're looking for. Well, they work really hard on controlling their emotions. So make sure they don't show any. Denial. I acknowledge my fear, but I replace it with the inside of awareness. Yeah, they're in total denial. They're denying the fact that they have no balance in their life. <laughs> They're trying to balance denial and happiness. And <laughs> it's not going to happen, mate. It's not healthy at all. <laughs> but, yeah, it's all about the health of their self-esteem, their ego. Yeah. They're in denial of the fact of what they're doing. And Three of Swords. Denying the fact that they're doing all this because they have been heartbroken. <sighs> yeah, they gave... Gave a little bit of love to someone that had turned into a nightmare. Committed to somebody that left them a wounded warrior. So now they see stability as a, at a crossroads. Neither don't want to make a choice about it. Too conflicted about it. Not because of heartbreak. Nah. All right, let's see what this. I've got a lot of names going through my head, but I don't know if I should say any of them. Uh, I don't know what you see in me. That's yeah. Why? Why would you bother with this sort of person, Capricorn? They don't get it. They know that they're no good. They treat themselves like no good and treat everyone around them no good. So, mm, what would this energy like to say to Capricorn, please? I can guarantee most of it will be lies, but... Mm, maybe we'll get some honesty. Never know. I doubt it. You turn me on. Well, yeah, well, that would be honest. <laughs> of course you do, Capricorn. You're hot. I bury myself in work to forget you. Yeah, this is that working on that not feeling anything. Because as soon as they feel any emotions, they bury themselves on, in working on not feeling anything. Forgetting about you. Oh, no, 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 no. Can't feel emotions. And I'm in a codependent situation right now. Yes, you are, mate. Yeah, they're not, they're not independent, they're not stable, they're codependent on other people to make them feel good about themselves. And it's your fault if they don't. And I just want to be single. They do. They just want to stay single and just play. Be, expect everybody else to um, heal them. There we go. And once you make them, that's exactly right, once you make them feel better... They'll go off and be single. They'll come to you for love and support and for you to make them feel better and then they're gone. Yep, it's a service. See, this is what I was talking about here with this service card. And look at the picture. Someone in bed who is sick needs to heal. They get you to do that and then they leave you with a mess. Once you've done your service to them, which is make them feel better. Ugh. Stay away from this one, Capricorn. Really? Ugh. Just wasting your time. All right. Well, that's the warning. <laughs> that's the reading. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Be nice in the comments. I like nice comments. Um, all that good stuff. And thanks for watching. All the best. Take care. Good luck. And I'll catch you later.